hi guys welcome back to my channel can you even see me i feel like it's like not focused okay cool hi welcome back i just woke up i wanted to do a morning routine i literally already like got out of bed brushed my teeth brushed my hair and then i was like i should film like a quick little vlog style morning routine to kind of show you guys how i get ready for the day it is currently a monday so it's a new start to a week so i feel like my monday morning routines are a little bit more put together than normal morning routines um i don't have an early morning workout on mondays i normally do on tuesdays and thursdays so i have a little bit more time to kind of like do my own thing get started a little bit later so i just woke up and i brushed my teeth literally right when i ro rolled out of bed brush my teeth brush my hair and then i wrote in my five minute journal that i keep right next to my bed right here and this is a great thing i'll link it down below for you guys to check it out um i've been writing in it it's been a year i, I think it's been a year um but yeah it's a great little reminder to write down like what you're grateful for and things that would be like make you happy today and like affirmations and stuff like that the little quote i'll read for you guys though when we fulfill our function which is to truly love ourselves and share love with others then true happiness sets in and i don't know why but that one really resonated with me today because i feel like i always try to just truly love everyone around me and show so much like positivity to people so it like makes me love myself more like give myself more love um but yeah anyway just woke up and now it is time for coffee i need coffee so bad so, oh my god wait i forgot to show you guys i got a little jewelry box for my dresser to throw all my jewelry in because it was just like laying all here and then i cleared this a little bit and just put just has perfumes on it but yeah, just wanted to show you guys a little bit of an update. Cute. <laughs> I'm like not going to show you guys fully, but I don't know about you. I love wearing boxers to bed. So I always wear boxers for some reason to bed. And then it's like if I don't wear, normally I don't wear a shirt. I kind of just like wear like boxers or shorts, like something like that. Boxer shorts or um, I think they're called boy shorts that are from Victoria's Secret. And they're literally just like underwear, but shorts i like wearing those to bed so comfy get on the wave coffee here is what i use for my coffee la Clome cold brew and then i do a splash of this almond milk anyway i am sitting down right now my chair is so squeaky I'm sitting down right now and i'm going to plan out my day next three days week um on my planner so i just have this get that list off of my planner i just have this 2021 planner it has all these moon faces on it and it is by the brand seedlings it's so funny i actually met the girl who her mom owns this company whoa her mom owns this company i think it's her mom can you not move i think it's her mom and her grandfather um but i met the girl she was at I want to say I met her, I think we just met her like on Newberry Street or at like the Bruins game or something, but no, we met her at the Red Sox game. I was like trying to think of what game it was, um, but we met the girl who her mom and her grandfather owned this company at the Red Sox game and it was so cool meeting her because I didn't know that one, I think she said that this is local, which I didn't know. They sell it at Anthropology, which is so cool. Imagine having your own company being sold at like a big store like anthropology or even like i know some people that have come out with uh, makeup lines that are sold at like sephora that's just so cool to me that that type of stuff can happen because it's like these big big name stores and your product is in those stores i don't know i just that's just so cool and i'm proud of if anyone has any of their small business items in a big store that's like a big accomplishment whoa i can't talk today but anyway it's the week of june 7th this vlog is going to be late late like i don't know when this vlog is going to be up i have three to go up before this so this might be like later on in life <laughs> anyway um i'm planning for the week of june 7th to 13th camera 
Okay, anyway, planned out my week. I leave for Chicago Thursday morning. I'm going to, I've never been to Chicago before. I'm actually so excited to go and see what it's like. I love traveling to different cities. And now that like vaccines are out and stuff like that, traveling is just so much easier. But I'm going to see two of my friends who actually go to school there. And I'm gonna go hang out with them for the weekend and finally get to see them after not being able to for so long. I'm so excited to go and hang out. Yeah, so I'm gonna enjoy my coffee and chill before I like go on a walk or work out or something. I don't know what I'm gonna do yet. Guys, every time I turn on my TV, Deal or No Deal comes on. And I'm just like, please no. So let's go to, what do I want to watch? I don't know if you guys can see my TV because of the glare, but this is my friend Jessica Stockstill's video. For her baby sky oh my god yeah that must be nice yeah oh that's good yeah they're measuring it they're getting it level um with my mom for like 30 minutes or so but I'm gonna do a quick Pilates workout right now I have my little aloe set on and I'm gonna do Pilates <laughs> I've been really loving at home Pilates workouts my god I'm so 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 tired still like I'm not tired but my body is just like definitely could have kept sleeping but I just I feel like I have so much to do today that I couldn't keep sleeping this morning I like was thinking about how much I have to get done so I woke up and I just like stayed awake but um anyway I love doing at home Pilates workouts because I love Matt Pilates. Matt Pilates is the first form of Pilates that I ever have done. And so it's my like, what I know. And it's my favorite type of Pilates, Matt Pilates. I love Reformer, don't get me wrong. I feel so long when I do Reformer. <laughs> um, but yeah, Matt Pilates is probably one of, one of my favorites. So I'm doing Tasha Franken's Pilates. And I'm gonna do should I do a meditation after today? Maybe. She's so pretty. Look at how beautiful she is. Like face structure, perfect eyebrows, eyes, lips, nose, like all of it. She reminds me, like the look reminds me of like Margot Robbie. Oh my God, Margot Rob Robbie is literally beautiful. But anyway, those are my like celebrity girl crushes i feel like everyone has like their like celebrity celebrity girl crush that they love using this booty band today Seven, nice and simple. Six, five, make sure that left foot, the top of the foot that's on the mat is pressing into the mat, focusing on that stability, use the core. Three, two, 
one, hold it up long, you're gonna hip square, three, two, one, hold it long, slowly bring it down. We're gonna get straight into the left side before we add the booty band on, so grab, lengthen the left leg long, make sure hips are square, nice and tall, tap down, up, down, up, ten, nine, eight, squeeze, seven, six, use that breath, five, make sure you're not dumping down at the shoulders, everything is lifted, two, squeeze, five, four more, three, two, just finished Pilates, I always feel so like, snatched and like toned and my stomach just feels so like strong you know like my core feels so strong after those workouts but yeah I just finished Pilates and it was a really good burn I feel like I don't sweat a lot unless it's like a heated class but this one is just so hard that it's like heart rate goes up that you get like hot and red like after class I mean it's been a little bit after class but after class, I literally get like red in the face. Anyway, <laughs> I'm about to hop in the shower and then I have some stuff I need to do. I need to, and then I need to figure out breakfast after I shower. I don't know about you guys. I like can't like eat yet until I'm showered after a workout, even if I'm like hungry, which I'm really hungry right now. I need to eat, but like I need to shower first. I don't know. Maybe it's just me and I'm crazy, but we're going to see what the plan is. I don't know if Maggie and I are going to get coffee this morning. I mean, I already had coffee, but we normally get coffee. So I have to wait for her to text me. I'm gonna ask her actually, see what's up and then see what the vibe is. But till then, showering right now. I'm like debating on washing my hair in the shower. I washed it. When did I wash my hair? Yesterday? I think I washed my hair yesterday. And it's like not dirty. No, I washed my hair Saturday night. It's not dirty at all, but I don't know if I should like wet it or if I should let it just be like natural today. Cause I think I'm gonna have to, I might like blow dry it later or something, but I can't wait to get it done. My roots are so dark. I'm always questioning with myself. Do I continue going blonde? Do I go back to my natural color? Do I do balayage? Like, I don't know. Because I love my blonde hair, but then it's like, when it's in between not being done and then getting it done next time, it's like basically brown. So, ugh, I don't know. Shower time though. shampoo or blue shampoo I don't I honestly don't know I don't know either one I did it in the shower so whenever I do it it leaves my hair a bit dry so today I'm gonna do a little bit more of like a hair nice treatment um, but first skincare so let's get into that oh normally I have ice roll my face Let me go get my ice roller. Here is the ice roller I use. This is just the Skinny Confidential ice roller. It's so cute and pink. And I just roll out my face. I feel like I find, I find that I have a really puffy face in ice rolling and using a gua sha has helped my skin so, so, so much. Not only like with acne, but just with swell. Not only with acne, but like with swelling too. Like I just ice rolled this twice and it's already a lot less swollen than this cheek. I don't know if you guys can even see it on camera, but if you were here in person, you'd be able to tell. And then I just like roll my neck. Okay. Then I also like to roll my chest. I don't know why, 
I like think this is a thing, but all I know is that it just feels so, so good to do. Like, oh my God. Now, we are going in with my all time favorite serum. This is Alotiva Power Elixir Waterless Face Serum. You guys can use my code if you guys want to. I'll put it on the screen for you to try out this serum. It's really, really good. I love it. It's my holy grail. I've been using it since, I want to say February, and I've seen such a big difference in my skin. Since using it, I use it right before I wash off. Also, this serum is really good for the summertime because if you're out in the sun a lot, like I've been outside a lot lately, so if my face gets a little bit of extra color, it has aloe in it, which is really hydrating, and it's a waterless serum, so not it's not necessarily waterless, it's just that it doesn't use as much water as normal other, like other serums, other skincare products, because normally... I'm literally going on a tangent, but other skincare products use more water so it dilutes what the serum actually has in it, then it's like what is it doing for your skin other than putting water in like a tiny bit of like other products, but this one is somewhat waterless, it just has more ingredients than water, like it has more products than water in it, and it has really good products for your skin, like goji berries, several different hyaluronic acids, oh, it's like skin food. And then I'm putting on my AM moisturizer. This is just the Elta MD Skincare AM Therapy Moisturizer. And then I use this Color Science SPF 50 for your skin every single day, even if it's like cloudy outside I still use SPF so good for your skin I love the color science one I do two lines on my middle finger and my rim finger and then I put it all over my face today's a hot day though super sunny day UV index is going to be high so I will be reapplying during the day I'm going to put some more on my neck. And I'm doing my beauty counter lip conditioner peppermint. And now for hair. I'm going to start out with, is this getting everywhere? Oh my god, this is open. I'm doing the Oplex bonding oil. This stuff smells amazing. I like need more. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna put deodorant on before I do my hair. Or else I'll like forget. <laughs> okay, I'm back. I just put on a little Joel Brown basic tank and some Heavy Manners sweats. But going in for my hair. And this is what I'm going to use on my hair. It's a little bit dry. Like I said, I put my purple shampoo in it. So I'm using the r Co. Pinstripe Intense Detangling Spray to make sure I don't rip my hair when I'm brushing it. And I'm just gonna like spray this everywhere. And then I'm going in with my Oplex Bonding Oil. throwing a ton of this in my hair. I like have to hurry. Oh my God, I need to hurry because I need to, I like have a meeting at 12. So it's like almost 12. Oh my God, my hair is like so dry today. It's so not good. Has my hair gotten longer or am I like crazy? And then, I'm going to use this Sun Catcher Power C Boosting Leave-In Conditioner by r &Co. and I'm going to throw a few pumps of this 
into my hair, like a nickel amount. I haven't seen a nickel in so long. I hate like paper money or like change and stuff, but I feel like I haven't seen a nickel in forever. Or a dime. I see pennies everywhere in quarters, but are, what happened to them? <laughs> Any, has anyone seen them? Because I haven't. Really random, but <gasps> I almost just broke my nail. go now we're now I take a different blow dry head after I like air dry not air dry but like put the blow dry my hair Take a head and go through. I like to just do this to the front pieces of my hair to kind of, you know, get my bangs going. Even if it falls, it just kind of like adds, adds a little bit of texture to my straight freaking hair. Okay. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Cool beans. Last thing I showed you guys was my skincare. But anyway, I am going to end off this little morning vlog. Morning in my life. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what my morning was like today. I have so much work to get done, so I need to get that started. I have a few errands I need to run right before I have an appointment to go to, and then I have to do all of my work and get that done. So that is the end of my morning. It is already two. I went over to my sister's house and I actually forgot to film what we ate bro. Anyway, <laughs> that's it. Didn't get to show it to you guys. I'm sorry for that, but anyway, you get the gist. That's the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys like seeing this. And yeah, see you guys in my next one. Mwah. Bye guys.